What's up, girly? Welcome to the weekend vlog. My name is Michael. I love all things pink and girly. Hello Kitty, Jessica Couture, Barbie, but I'm a boy. That's what I identify as. Right now, I'm about to go shopping for TikTok. I'm going to a shopping center that has all of my favorite stores, and I want to find a bunch of pink Christmas decor. I need to, dec I need to decorate for Christmas, and I'm so freaking excited. I just ordered a nice coffee from Dunkin' and a sandwich, and I didn't really have time to pull up my camera, and I've come to the conclusion that my hair just looks pretty bad today. I don't know if I like oversprayed it and then try to fix it too much, but maybe I'm just tripping. Maybe I'm just feeling insecure, but I don't like my hair today. Can I do Apple Pay? Thank you. Finish straw. Thank you. That was so weird. What's up, girl? I just got to the shopping center. There's Burlington, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, Ulta, Hobby Lobby, Five Below, um, TJ Maxx, like literally so many stores. <laughs> this is the RCL Beauty RCL Glow or RCL RCL Beauty Gloss. Thought about putting a little perfume on my arms too because I was wearing a jacket whenever I sprayed my perfume and then I took that jacket off. So I'm gonna use this little Nicki Minaj travel size one that I just have on me. Just something for the arms. And I need to start a TikTok. I'm actually doing two TikToks right now so that's always really fun to do at once. Oh, and my drink I got is so freaking good. What's up, girly? I'm at my favorite shopping center with Burlington, TG Maxx, Home Goods, Ota, Hobby Lobby, Five Below. We're gonna go to all those stores and we're gonna try to find some pink Christmas decorations. What's up, girly? I'm at my favorite shopping center with Burlington, TG Maxx, Home Goods, Ota, Hobby Lobby, Five Below. We're gonna go to all those stores and we're gonna try to find some pink Christmas decorations. What's up? I got makeup around my shirt. What's up, girly? We're going to all the stores and we're going to find all the pink Christmas decorations. What's up, girly? We're going to all the stores and we're going to find all the pink Christmas decorations. What's up, girly? We're going to all the stores and we're going to find all the pink Christmas decorations. Oh my gosh, it's insane how much money I just spent on pink Christmas decor, but you all, I found literally so much. I can't wait to go through all this with you. Right now, I need to chill for a minute and then we need to figure out a game plan on how I'm going to start decorating, where I'm going to put the tree. We just got a lot we got to figure out, okay? I'm just going to start pulling stuff out of the bag so that way I can lay it out and we can look at it all. I got so many Christmas lights. Got this little baby Jesus set. Just thought it was cute. Go under the tree. I also got a piece to go with it that I can like paint. Got this little Merry Christmas. Some more lights. This with a lot of the boring stuff. I got this cute little tree. Silver little tree thing. I got this. I thought about painting it pink. Some extra little trees. I know this ain't like the best lighting in the world. A little sign that says joy. Stop, Cash. She's already chewing on that little tree. Hey, stop. Girl. This is my pink nutcracker. He matches the silver one that I got while we were thrifting before. Little Merry Christmas sign. The theme is obviously like pink and silver. Oh, I just got this for me. It says work so hard you can shop harder. I really like that. Some cute little bows. This whole thing which need batteries but it lights up. At Burlington, I got this little guy. I got this cute little car. So here's the plan. I'm gonna take a tote and I'm gonna take some stuff down because as like a maximalist, I have pretty much everywhere that I want filled. So there's only a few blank spots. So I'm gonna take some things down that I can put back to that I can put back up after Christmas. So I need to go out to the shed after this, even though it's dark. I hate going out at dark. 
and get um, a tote, at least one tote, I guess. I also have more Christmas decorations. I don't know if they're out in the shed or if they're in this closet back here, but I'll get into those and I'll show you what else I have. Some of those stuff I just bought recently, which you like already saw. I got these cute little high heel ornaments. I got this cute little cup. It's an ornament cup. I got four. What are them cats up to? I got four of these little heart things that just hang from something. I got this little ornament. It's like a pink purse. It's so... It's, it didn't break. Thank God. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's a pink purse. It's so cute. Also got this. as Mary and Bright. Just like another little something silver. Oh, another one of these little heart things. Maybe I got five. I know she ain't watching this YouTube video, but I got my mom. Oh my God. I'm just like trying to break something. <laughs> I got my mom this little nurse thing. Just nurse ornament. I can't believe I'm dropping everything. Oh, what the heck? That time that I dropped it on this, it broke this. But I can super glue that or hot glue that. What the heck? Like, the universe doesn't want me to have this. This might be haunted. So many more bags still. I got this tree skirt because my tree is pink and everything's pink. And I didn't want to get a pink tree skirt and the pink be like an off pink. So, fuzzy white. I got this cute little um, stocking for me. I want to get stockings for my cats too, but they, they had little ones, but no little pink ones. I also got two of these things to maybe hang around like my mirror that I have in here or just hang anywhere. Ooh, they could actually go, I don't know, we'll see. Oh, when I was at Burlington, there was a girl who saw me looking at this and she was like, oh, you should get that, that would be cute on you. And so I was like, okay, let me get it. Look at this little thing. This is perfect for like winter. This is for my online friend, he loves Ed Hardy and so I just got this for him. Funny, he just texted me. I got this cute little Santa napkin holder but I'm not sure if I'll put napkins in it or do something else with it. But I didn't find too much for the kitchen. Although some of these, like the bows and stuff, they can go in the kitchen. I did get these to put in a bowl in the kitchen. Oh god, the screen's behind me. I did grab these to put in a bowl in the kitchen. I thought it would be cute to do like a little TikTok making, putting up all my cute pink decorations. I honestly thought about doing it tonight. It's like 8.35. I don't ever stay up late, but we get an extra hour tonight. The time sets back and I don't know. When else am I going to get all this extra time to hang up all this? But my tree is the longest part. If it was just this, I would easily do it, but the tree is so long. And some of these lights I might put outside, but I'm not, I'm not going to record the outside. I'm just going to record the inside. But let's get into it. I still got some more. Oh my gosh, these Christmas socks were freaking adorable. I got these at TJ Maxx. They were $8, but it's three pairs. Five Below has some really cute stuff. So I don't even know what I'm going to do with these, but I got these like large ornaments. I might put them in the tree if they look right. I got three of those. Three of these large pink ornaments. And then I got two of these ornament pillows. I'll probably definitely throw these on the couch just next to my other gray pillows. I was looking for pink pillows all day, like pink Christmas pillows, and I... I didn't really find any so I didn't get any and then I was like why didn't I look for white or like gray because that's the pink on the pink on the couch is sometimes too much you know but these are so effing cute I also I also got this little Hello Kitty plush this is just for me a little squish mellow she's also Christmas themed so maybe I'll put her on the couch I got these two little snowflakes just to add somewhere I really wanted to feel like Christmas for me this season I got this super cool candle, just like, I love candles that are shaped like things, and this is perfect for pink Christmas. I also got these two candles, which smell so freaking good. Here's the lid to it, which is also pretty cute, but they're pink. I got two of them. Oh my god, I'm obsessed with these scents, and also just the packaging is so cute. I got those at Home Goods, and then I also got this at Home Goods. I think I got some of these from Timu, and I'm gonna be adding the Timu stuff. Like, it's literally over there whenever I decorate, too. So, honestly, maybe I should start getting some of that stuff out, too, so I can look at it. Let me go get the stuff from my uh, glam room that I. that I've already bought. 
So I already got these two Christmas trees whenever I was at Target because I thought they were pretty cute and I was like Christmas fiending. And then I got this pink Santa at Burlington with you guys in that one vlog. I also found this Betsy Johnson little bath mat, but I'll probably honestly put it in like the kitchen or the living room just to add a little bit of Christmas spice. I've gotten this silver nutcracker, which honestly goes perfect with my pink nutcracker. I think they're, um, I think they're dating. Yeah, look at them. They're all like height difference. This pink one is me. And this silver one's my future man. Oh my gosh, we're so cute. I love us. Let's grab the team with stuff real quick too. I ordered this tree. I thought it was pink, but it's kind of giving more red. But I was thinking of maybe setting it up in the glam room. Which I still probably will. We could still pink it up. Look at my cat. She's trying to mess with everything. I also got this pack of ornaments from Team Mill. They were like, you know, obviously super cheap. Even though I had to pay for it because, you know brand deal. I found these little cherries just to add somewhere. I almost forgot about this. They're light up little snowman so you can add this anywhere. They're red not pink. Wish they were pink but it still goes. I got a couple Christmas sweaters. Let's see what the sweaters. This sweater is so cute. I also got this sweater. I think this one yeah this one has a flamingo on it. And then I had gotten a couple of these little Santa towels so honestly I don't know if I'll use these or if I'll use the other ones but I got a couple spots so I could use both. I had gotten this sign off of Timu that says I'm dreaming of a pink kitchen. I mean, a, a pink Christmas. I also got these Christmas slippers, which I already had tried on, and they're a size too small. So I'll probably give these away to someone. I don't even remember getting these. I think these are like window stickers. I don't know if I use it or not. Maybe I'll take them to work if I don't want to use it here. I'd also gotten some bows. They're not pink. They are silver and um, red, though. Maybe these are for, like, presents, but... Who knows? Now this is really cute. I got one of these to put on my glam room chair. Well, it's actually a four pack, but it's just like little chair covers and they look like Santa hats. You put them on the back of chairs. They're so freaking cute. I also got this little pink train, which the packaging is like a busted, but that's okay because the train is in good condition. Now when I ordered this, I don't even know. I honestly thought, it, I think I thought I ordered something rhinestone, but something that you rhinestone yourself. So I don't know what's, what's the deal with that. I also got these little straw toppers. I also, <laughs> my kit, it just like stopped recording. But I had also got these straw toppers. They're so cute. And then I got some Christmas cookie cutters. So who knows? Maybe I do some Christmas cookies or something. I think I was just trying to add up like the dollars at that point, get the most from my brand deal money. There is so much in front of me. I'm about to throw up. This is actual insanity, but like I'm so excited to put all this around my house now because I know this place is about to be so festive. Turn on the big light so you can really see just the detail of everything. Oh my gosh. This is so much to put away. It's like I want to do it tonight, but can I even do all this tonight? I can do it. We'll see. What's up, girl? I just got out the shed getting my Christmas tree and the rest of my decorations. If you see a spider on me, let me know, because that was like scary and gross. I don't like going in the shed that much, but this is what I got, and that's my pink tree. For some reason, half of my decorations were spilled out and like ruined and in this wet substance, so, and not really my good decorations, just like my ones like this. So honestly, I'm happy I got that from Timu, because all mine are MIA, but I got all my like unique decorations, I think, or at least most of them. And then I got some lights. I got those silver things. Oh, it looks like a lot of them did make it down there. But th these are mainly just like my Christmas tree decorations and stuff. And honestly, I didn't have much house decorations before. I just found that and that thing in my closet. But I really couldn't afford to like go all out like this before. So this is really fun to me. I'm excited. I don't know what to do now. Maybe I should get dressed up cute and do a little TikTok putting all this together. Maybe I could film it too for YouTube. I don't know, this is so much. Look at the cats, they're like, what's going on? I'm obviously out of breath. I need to get myself together and like get cute again if I'm really gonna do this TikTok tonight and figure out how to do my freaking tree because like I want the tree to go there but it's a normal size tree, you know, it's pretty fat. I think it would be about like that. So maybe I can move it down enough. I just don't want none of that to like throw me off, you know, if you know what I mean. I even debated like putting it there, but I don't want to block that mirror, ignore my knees. 
I've debated putting it everywhere here. I've debated the toy room. Last year, I had gotten this entertainment center on like the 20th. Like Christmas wasn't over yet whenever I got it. I moved my Christmas tree from here to my bedroom just for like the last couple days because I was so excited to have it. So I never really tried to make it work with this entertainment center, but it might. Just like I don't have anywhere else for it to go in here, you know? And you gotta have it in the living room where you can see it. I'll figure it out, girly, and you'll just, you'll have to see what I do next. What's up, girly? It's time for a little update. I've done so much already. I've done everything except for the tree, which we're about to do together. But I just wanted to show you, like, some of the little details I got going on right here. It's starting to look very Christmassy. I put this mat right here. I put this light right here, which only I, I need to get batteries for. So I got my stockings up. I got that up. I got this cute little setup going on. Obviously, I don't have any of the lights on yet. It looks so much better with the lights on, but I did put some lights up there. I put some lights over around there and I put these random like ornaments over here thought that was pretty cute oh my gosh there's so much laundry y'all I need to get done on my laundry but it's starting to look really freaking cute I put down this little area down here I thought it was cute I even got my little ornaments on the couch it's just all coming along so cute I'm literally so happy with this I need to get some lights to put outside still but right now we're gonna set up and we're gonna do this tree real quick before bed. Here's another little detail I wanted to show you. These little bows I put right here are so cute. I only put one right there because they were just too much hitting together. And I got some like of those little cherry things right there. Got my ornament drink. I'm all done. It's been quite the night. I kind of stopped doing little putting the ornaments on the Christmas tree because I noticed that the Christmas tree was like glitching on the camera. Let's see if it still does it. Yeah, I don't know how this is going to turn out in editing, but it's like the lights. Oh my gosh. 
It works, it looks fine on my phone. Here's when you get close, but it's doing something weird on my camera. So like, look at my little camera ornament. Look at that, maybe it's just like the settings I have on. I could probably mess with the settings and it would stop, but got my little setup under there. I just wanna show you everything else real quick. You've seen these glow stones, I mean glow, 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 <laughs> what are they called? Snow glows before, but I got like matching candles and I put this little truck right here and I just put their lids beside them because I thought that their lids were pretty cute. I got these lights up over here, let it focus. Here we go, it looks pretty cute. I just wanted to put something up there and then I got like my little bowl of candy right here and I got a little Santa right there. Put some random bows right here, but I wish I had gotten more of these bows so I could put them everywhere. But I just put like one right there and then I put these little heart things I had gotten down here. Cabinets look a little dirty. But then I put that thing around there. I think it looks super cute. I'm waiting to put those in the fridge. And then I put these just right here since I was gonna put them around the mirror. I didn't know what to put around the mirror. I'm glad I thought of that. I think that's really cute. And then I put it over here, but once again, I got a lot of laundry I don't wanna talk about. But I think those look pretty cute right there. And then I got the fish tank and I just put those right there beside the fish tank because there was really nowhere under the tree that they would fit. Also got like the little gnome right there, the joy sign, the little snowman up here. I got my little ornament pillows. I really love how over here came out. Like I'm probably going to leave the work hard so you can shop harder. I'll probably leave that there. And then just the way the snowflakes and the little train and everything came out. I really like even this little rug right here I think is cute. I got that little Christmas tree right here but I need to get some batteries for it. I even put some stuff outside but I'm not going to show you it. I changed stuff right here. I just took down a couple Funko Pops so that way I could add some Christmas decor. And then this is just kind of like my essentials cart. I put like everything that I need over here. And then you got me in the mirror still wearing my Christmas sweater. I had so much fun and now I have a lot of footage for TikTok I can go edit. So that's going to be really fun. I probably won't post it tonight because it's already midnight. But the time is going back an hour so I can't remember the last time I was up whenever the time actually changed. So that's really exciting. I feel like this lighting from the tree is kind of throwing me off. Let me go, let me go over here. This is like where I chill. I got the lighting to chill out a little bit. I don't know, I think so, but I'm getting really sleepy. So I think I'm gonna eat a little snack and just go to bed. Definitely in the Christmas mood now. I cannot wait to actually go shopping for people and I'm so happy that the tree worked out. See, I just moved the entertainment center and everything worked out good. Although, why does it literally keep glitching like that? It's so weird. Like it doesn't do that on my iPhone, you know? But I love the cozy Christmas feel. Oh my gosh, it makes me so happy. What's up, girlie? It's the next day. I just woke up and I had to run to the gas station real quick to pick up some Rillos. I really don't talk about that often because I don't recommend it. But I still have all my Christmas lights on. Oh my gosh, it was so pretty last night. I need to go ahead and turn them off since obviously it's daylight. But I just wanted to show you my little gas station fit. It was pretty cute. I'm not gonna lie and it's a little bit warm outside today so I love whenever I get to dress for the warmth. I woke up early and I shaved my legs just so I could go to the gas station real quick and then after I chill for just a minute I'm gonna go to Meyer and I'm gonna grocery shop. That's always so much fun. It's grocery shopping day. I'm gonna get stuff to clean out the fish tank because we need to clean it today. I want to vacuum the rocks and I need to like scrub the walls, add some water to it. You know you need new filters when the water is not flowing smoothly. Like you see how it's like kind of broken up. I use my filters for like a while, honestly, not a while, but like a month or two, and I would just take them after a month and kind of like clean them the best that I can, but they only last you like two or three months before you need completely new filters. But I don't think you're supposed to do it too often because you want the fishes to be like in their germs, do you know? But I deep deep clean it about once a month, once every half a month, but I clean it like just scrub the walls so it looks fresh, like almost every weekend. So chill. I also have leftover Chinese food, so I'm gonna be eating some of that for lunch, and then and then I'll go to Meyer. But I'll do a little check-in probably whenever I get back from Meyer, whenever we're ready to clean out the fish tank. What's up, girlie? It's a little bit later, and it's time for me to clean this fish tank. I think I'm just gonna set up my camera somewhere and set some little music to it, so you can see everything that I really do. I'm also probably doing a little TikTok, like a little just Sunday reset, and I wanted to do filming the little fish tank too, because I've never cleaned the fish tank for TikTok either. So I thought that would be fun. Airplane, so rude. But yeah, here's how it looks before, and then I'm gonna add some water to it, some new filters, and this part over here, it's always like a little bit crusty, dusty looking, so I just, let's not even zoom in on it.
What's up really we're back as you can see the fish take us all done I don't know where the video ended off it just like turned off But it was honestly kind of hard to vacuum the rocks today because they are just feeling aggressive I don't know why but Oscars are just like really aggressive and I feel like a lot of people just don't know a lot about Oscars But they're totally they act different than other fish like they're kind of like dogs of the water if you know what I mean I almost said the ocean, but I don't know if they live in the ocean. Their water will clear up in about a day. It just, it's all the chemicals I just put in to like make sure that the water stays clear. I definitely put in too much water. I need to clean that thing. It looks so bad. Like I just cleaned it. I literally just cleaned it on video. But I think I need to take like a knife and scrape at it. But I literally don't feel like doing that right now. But um, definitely filled up the water too much. You can tell by the way it's vibrating right there. But it's okay. It's way quieter. Oh, y'all kissing? No, they're fighting. I just fed them a second ago, but we'll give them a little bit more. They were good boys. I mean, honestly not. They kept trying to attack me. Let's see if they go crazy. Like, I literally caught them going crazy on camera. Oh, y'all acting so cute right now. A little bit sweet. No, they were trying to jump out and stuff. <laughs> Even Ariel dropped in the tank at one point. It's just so cute. I got these fishes, well actually my ex wanted these fishes. We had a much smaller tank before and we got the first one, this Oscar right here, cause he just like wanted a fish in the tank that I had. And then a week later we got that one and I didn't even think they would live this long but apparently they live for a long time. So I'm in it for the long haul with these guys. My ex did not treat them right, like their tank used to look horrible. I definitely did so much research like after we broke up but at first I was like not the primary caretaker. But I got this fish tank off Facebook Marketplace, the whole thing, and he painted it pink for me. It has this little inner crack, but they said that the glass is so thick that, like, it doesn't matter. I mean, it's been over a year, but it's still, like, a little fear of mine. Like, I, I don't like that. So, one day I would like to upgrade, but I don't really need to right now. Film that for TikTok, so I might go ahead and film a couple other things, too. Like, putting away my dishes and my laundry just so I can upload, like, a little Sunday reset. Like, clean my fish tank with me, stuff like that, you know? I do a little check in later, but I'll probably end this video later too because I don't have any other plans and I kind of want to start like just random vlogging throughout the week, not just doing weekend vlogs unless I have something planned for the weekend, but I feel like this weekend was a little bit short and maybe boring because I didn't have anything planned, but that's okay. I love just like hanging out anyways, as long as you like it, I like it. What's up girl? I think I'm ready to end this vlog here. I know it's probably been a short weekend, hopefully not too boring for you, but anyways, I have so much fun anytime we vlog, so make sure you have already subscribed please like and comment so i have motivation to keep going i know i'm a little bit of a mess sometimes sometimes i really don't know what i'm doing but i'm i'm learning and i'm growing and i'm so glad that you're here with me and i just love chilling with you but i hope you guys had fun i had so much fun there's an airplane going by so rude no because i guess how wait daylight savings happened or whatever it's called and so we gained an hour and i feel like that really was helpful but what time does it get dark now does it get dark later it's what time is it right now it's 5 41 it's already getting dark it definitely gets dark earlier just make sure that you have the post notifications on so you never miss my video what's the odds of another freaking plane so you never miss my video and i'll catch you in the next vlog i seriously love you bye